Hello, sweetie. Welcome home. How was your day? I'm so glad. Oh, why don't you go change up and let me cook food so we can go sit and eat together? Sound good? What? What is it? Oh, are you feeling okay? You don't look so good. You sure? Doesn't look like it to me. Wait, come here. Oh, dear. You have a fever. No, you are not okay. Here, I'll help you to our bed. And here you go. Let me go get the thermometer. Here we go. Let me check. What do you mean, no? Sweetie, come on. Let me check. I'm worried about you, you know? You're fine? Uh, no, you're not. You look even worse than you did before. Now, stop rambling and let me check your temperature. <gasps> oh my gosh! The temperature is so high! You have a really bad fever! Oh no, oh no, oh no! Sweetie, my love! I, I need you to get medicine, quick. What do you mean, no, I'm fine? You're clearly not. Wait, right here. I'll bring the medicine. Okay, here I am. I got the medicine and a glass of water. Take the medicine, come on. Oh, come on, just take the medicine. It will help you feel better. And you'll get better sooner. Sweetie, I said take the medicine. There you go. See? Oh, don't look scared. I'm not mad. I just don't like it when you don't listen to me. It's much better when you listen to me. I don't want you to be scared of me. I'll never hurt you. If I get mad, it's for your own good. I remember how we met. It, it wasn't the best. The way you were trembling in fear when you woke up? I remember I had to try so hard to calm you down. You even tried to escape me many times, but I managed to stop you. I am so glad you stopped trying. Finally gave in, and then we got married. <laughs> Sooner than you can even think about it. That aside, that medicine will heal you up in no time. Just calm down. There you go. What about your work? Seriously? Even when you're sick, you want to get your work done? You're not doing anything until you have recovered completely. But even then, I'm going to have to make some rules for your own good. Of course, what am I supposed to do? Let you just push yourself to your limits? Let you get tired or sick? Like you are right now? No. Not anymore. I'm going to have to do something about that. Besides, you're barely spending any time with me. It makes me really sad. You're still not used to me. You don't want me around you because you're scared of me. You're always busy with your work, and you're barely paying any attention to me. I have had enough of that. I am going to have to make some rules so I can make sure everything is going well for both me and you. No, you're not doing your work, okay? You're going to rest. Gosh, even after all that talk, you're still concerned about your work? I care about you, my love, and I don't want you pushing yourself and getting tired or sick just because of work. What about your boss? Oh, you think you're going to work tomorrow? Well, you're not. You're staying here. 
you're not going to go to work or anywhere until you've fully recovered. I'll take proper care of you because I love and care about you so much. Anything you want or need, you tell me and I'll get it for you. <laughs> what if you wanted to go to the bathroom? Well, what do you think a bucket is for? <laughs> sorry, sorry. I had to do it. Um, I'll take you there. So, you don't have to worry. That way, I can make sure you won't hurt yourself by falling down the stairs or something. Besides, I can stay close to you and spend some time with you. Your boss will get mad. Oh, don't worry about that. I'll be sure to have a nice chat with him, so don't worry about it, okay? You look scared again. I told you many times that you don't have to be scared of me. Besides, it's not like I'm going to kill him. Wait, did, did you think I was going to kill him? Seriously? Of course I won't kill him. I'll just have a little chat with him. Unless he makes me take drastic measures. Then I won't hesitate to take them. Just don't worry, okay? Nope. Begging or pleading won't work. You're not doing anything and you're not going anywhere. Got it? Good. Now, wait here. I got a bowl of water and a piece of cloth. Now lay down straight on the bed, will you, sweetie? This will help you, too. There you go. Now let me sit down. And let me put this on your forehead. Feeling better? I'm glad. There we go. I am so happy I'm taking care of you, my sweet love. You're mine. All mine. There we go. One last time. And then... I'll massage your legs, and that should take the pain and tiredness away. Oh, they don't hurt. Really, now. You could barely walk here. I am so glad that you made it home. You could have gotten in an accident, or passed out, or something much worse. Now, shush, okay? Okay, now let me massage your legs. You know, I can't wait for us to spend time together after you've fully recovered. Just you and me. We'll go to many, many places. You can take me where you want to, and I'll take you where you want to. We'll have a great time together. Okay, that should be enough. Feeling better? Great! See? Someone who loves and cares so much about you. And, of course, right now she is taking care of you. You should be grateful, sweetie. Now, you must be hungry, so let me get you something to eat. Hmm? What about me? Aww, look at that! You do care about me! <laughs> you look so cute when you're blushing! So cute! About me, I'll eat later. But first, I need to make sure that you've eaten. I won't eat anything until I make sure my love who's sick has eaten. Wait here. Here I am with some delicious soup for you, sweetie. Doesn't it look delicious? You know how great my cooking is. What? What's wrong? I see fear in your eyes again. I mixed something in the food last time? Well, um, that was for your own good, okay? I needed you to get some sleep because you were so panicked and scared of me. I haven't mixed anything after that, have I? Have I? Hmm? Exactly. Besides, why would I do it now? There's literally no reason at all, unless you give me one. Hey, hey, calm down! I am not going to do anything to you. 
Just stop and calm down. I was just saying, okay? Yeah, there you go. Just calm down. Now give me a second. Now let me just... There! And let me pick up the bowl of soup and sit down. There we go. Mission accomplished! <laughs> now, get up, sweetie. Good. Now open your mouth and let me feed you, sweetie. You don't want to? Sweetie, not this again. Just eat. Please, sweetie. You need to eat. You haven't eaten anything. You're still looking at me with those eyes. You know, you're really making me feel like a monster right now. And I've done nothing but take care of you and love you all this time. Again, I know how we met. But after that, I have done nothing but love you, take care of you, and assure you every time that you don't have to be scared of me. Yet you're still being so unwilling and ungrateful. Please, sweetie, I really care about you. I would feel really bad if you stayed like this. So please, eat. You're still worried that I mixed something in here? Here, let me prove you wrong. <sniffs> See? Nothing. Now please, eat. There you go, my sweet love. I'm so happy right now. You like it? Yay! I'm so glad you do. There you go. More? Wow, you're really hungry. If only you listened to me sooner. There. I'm glad you ate all of it. Now you have a full tummy. <laughs> Yay! I'm so happy. Now, before you go to sleep and get some rest, about the rules... I know, sweetie, but I have to do it. I don't want you struggling and tiring yourself out. And like I said, I barely get any attention. You know how much I enjoyed this? Taking care of you, talking to you, and feeding you? A lot, sweetie. So, here we go. Repeat after me, okay? Rule number one. Always take breaks from work every time you feel like taking a break. And don't push yourself. Repeat it, sweetie. Good! Now, rule number two. Whenever I tell you to stop and get some rest, you do it and don't tire yourself out. Repeat it. Okay, good. Rule number three. You give me love and attention like I give you love and attention. Repeat it, my love. Good job. Rule number four. If you don't feel like going out to buy stuff for the house or something you need, you come to me and tell me, okay? Repeat it, love. Very nice! And now, the final rule! You will try your hardest to feel comfortable around me and not continuously get scared of me, okay? Repeat the final one. Yay! I'm so glad! I love you so much, sweetie. I am happy. So happy that you're mine. All mine. No one else's. I'll never ever let you go because you're all mine sweetie or should i say husband <laughs> shh it's okay calm down don't be scared okay just go to sleep it's all okay just get some rest there you go sweetie now i'm gonna go and eat and then i'll be back okay I'll see you soon, okay, my love? Have a good rest. I love you so, so much.